Hello there, I'm Tas Baldadakis and I'm a full-time PhD student in the University of Stirling here in Scotland. I'm founded by the EU Horizon 2020 TAPAS project, which is evaluating and developing models, tools and approaches to support licensing and regulation of aquaculture in Europe. For my PhD, I'm focusing on the marine environment and the models that are used to plan and manage gauge aquaculture. As part of this, I'm looking at integrating multi-trophic aquaculture systems and the use of models to evaluate the biodegradation efficiency and capacity of an IAM system, specifically in Ireland. TAPAS partners, the Marine Institute, have set up a pilot-scale IMTA site on the west coast of Ireland, which consists of lobsters, hamarus, grammarus, located beside the salmon cage, along with pulva lactuca. I visited the site for a field sampling campaign to collect data that can parameterize and validate my models. First, we assess the natural environment status by assessing the water quality of the area, both close to the vicinity of the farms and the way. Regarding the water quality, we are looking for concentration of nutrients in the water, such as chlorophyll and particles. We are also analyzing the different species to assess nutrient uptake and access if the uva and lobsters are feeding directly from the waste of the salmon cages. This information is then used in models that can be used to support planning and management of aquaculture in coastal locations. So we are collecting uh, water samples from surface water and from 5 meters depth for specifically nitrogen, organic nitrogen. So we can put in numbers basically the, uh, the waste that's coming out from the salmon farm right next to us. And uh, we do that in three different stages of the tides. So because we need three different like current speeds and directions, so we can map the whole, uh, let's say, nutrient profile of the area uh, in five days, three times a day. So we can have a big uh, chunk of data to work on. And that's how we deploy. It's like really, it's really smart idea and it's really efficient. So you just deploy it. So the bottle, the Van Dorn bottle is open. So there is a marker for the five meters and then you send the so-called message. Keep in five meters. So it's filled with water now. So you send the message, hit the bottom, close up both of the valves and then you put it back up. And that's your five meters water. So that's how we sample the water. We have to wash the water about a few times and then that's it. This water, as we saw before, is going to go for uh, chlorophyll analysis. Find the cup. There it is. This down and we collect the surface water. That's us. Awesome.